Even T-Rex was surprised by the big turnout at the front of the Okanagan Science Centre as hundreds of people crowded in to take in the solar eclipse. Staff had set up solar binoculars and a telescope with a solar filter which allowed people a safe way of viewing the eclipse, but they quickly ran out of 200 eclipse glasses. I wasn't expecting this many people, but that's good. The more the merrier, because they can just keep sharing the glasses and taking a look. Yeah, you said that you ran out of glasses. Oh, yes. We may have had close to 200 that are someplace around here. No matter, people shared the glasses with nearby strangers. Others had brought homemade devices to watch the moon's progression across the face of the sun. The moon is like, it's still like the crescent, but it's like in front of the sun and it's, it's neat. No, it is just the sun, the moon and the earth getting lined up. But for scientists, it still is a big deal. During the total eclipse, it's a time to best look at the solar corona. The atmosphere of the sun is best seen during the total solar eclipse. We can't really mimic it. The best, the best we have is something called a coronagraph that blocks the light of the sun, but it's too blurry. For Castanet News, I'm Kate Bowie in Vernon. Big on business? Click the Okanagan Edge widget on the main page. The Okanagan Edge, positively business.